Hey guys, so I am coming to you to review these two products that I purchased around October and I tried both of these at least three times um, just to make sure that my hair reacted the way that I thought it did the first time around. So if you want to hear my thoughts about them, please keep watching. So first, let's start with the leave-in conditioner. This is actually my favorite. This leave-in leave -in conditioner, uh, again, is made with, oops, sorry, pomegranate, pomegranate and honey. <clears throat> and the directions and the, all the ingredients are listed right here. And the shelf, shelf life, in case you didn't know, some products do write their shelf life on the back this is 12 months okay so this is their story they wrote down everything for you and i really love this packaging it's really pretty and it smells really amazing guys i really love the smell and my hair really love this product it's about right here oops sorry it's about right here that I have left. I stopped using it because I only have one. And since my hair really, really loved it, I didn't want to finish it fast. <laughs> so I kind of left it for, you know, kind of save the best for last. It smells amazing, guys. And the consistency, as you can see, is pretty thick but not too thick at the same time. I'm still waiting for it. See, as you can see right here, right? I'm squeezing it still a little bit. So this is the consistency. It's not, it's creamy, but not, you know, not like those other liquid leave-ins and it feels really soft. When I did put on my hair, my hair felt instantly soft, moisturized, and it had enough slip for me to finger detangle my hair so this is actually my favorite i didn't purchase their smoothie or anything like that because i don't think i was going to use them so i only purchased the ones that i know for a fact that i would be using all right so moving on to the curling custard this curling custard is very liquidy um, compared to um, other custards, at least to me, is very liquidy. It's, it smells amazing too. Um, you know, the first four ingredients are water, glycerin, pectin, and hydrolyzed corn starch. So I'll put it so you guys, hopefully you guys. my thoughts about these about this my hair did not really like it it had it definitely had a lot of slip i really love that about it it had a lot of slip and you did not need a lot to coat your hair however there is an ingredient in here that makes my hair frizzier than it should um because as soon as I put in my hair, my hair kind of poofed up, I guess it got more poofy. For I did it on the section of a wash and go. I used the leave-in and the custard after, and it just, my hair felt frizzy. I don't know if you guys can see what I mean. See, it's very, it's liquidy, but like snot at the same time. <laughs> It's very it has a lot of slip smells amazing I'm not too sure what reacted to my hair and I would have to try it again maybe with another leave-in or I'm not too sure because I did not like the feeling that it had in my hair it did have some definition but because my hair kind of got frizzy and poofy I didn't use it on all the sections of my hair. So I used another custard that 
I thought worked better than this one. So overall, guys, I really love the smell for both of these. They smell amazing. It's not overpowering. I do have allergy sensitivity to certain fragrance, but this is not too overpowering for me. I love the smell. The leave-in is my favorite. This one, I'll have to keep trying it some type of way because I will not waste products. I'm not a person that just leaves it. I will not waste it. I'll keep using it until it finishes. And yeah, that's it guys. So let me know if you had, if you've tried these two products and had different results than me, if your hair really loved it. And I will do a demonstration using these two in the future. And I will compare it to another custard that I've been using. So you guys can see the difference. Alright guys, so let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thank you for watching guys. See you in the next video.